Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, who stepped down as working members of the royal family in January 2020, are now becoming increasingly involved in political issues. In the last few weeks, the Duchess of Sussex penned an open letter to Congress about paid parental leave. The pair also wrote a letter for leaders at COP26, talking about vaccine equity. But royal commentator Noel Phillips suggested the US public are getting fed up with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle because of their outspokenness. Mr. Phillips told GMB, having been speaking to a lot of people, there are a lot of people who are now saying we are team Harry and Meghan all the way. We fully support them and they have every right to be commenting on racial justice, on issues of equality, and fighting for rights for everyone. And there are people who are saying, listen, you know, there are stories that have emerged in the couple of in the last couple of days saying, Meghan has picked up the phone and has been ringing politicians asking them to vote for issues in Congress. Their people were saying that should absolutely not be happening. He continued, Meghan and Harry are two enlist celebrities they no longer have the royal platform that they once had. Obviously, they're now using their celebrity status to be as influential as they can. We didnt see them at COP26. We saw other members of the royal family so they're doing what they can. In a way, I think they're competing with the royal family to be as relevant and to be as prominent as they can, but I think overall sympathy is on the decline. I think people are just sort of getting fed up trying to figure out what are they are. Are they fighting for charity issues or are they just trying to get in every single issue that they see fit? Meghan was accused of lobbying US senators to vote for paid parental leave. Politicians have reported receiving phone calls showing caller ID block before hearing an introduction of, this is Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex. Politico reported that Maine Sen, Susan Collins, a moderate Republican, received a call on her private line when she was at the gym. Much to my surprise, she called me on my private line and she introduced herself as the Duchess of Sussex, which is kind of ironic. I was happy to talk with her, but I'm more interested in what the people of Maine are telling me about it, Collins added.